quick video to show what we're growing this season and the diary so sweet peas the first two there just normal garden peas there pod ones and then actual broad beans that's just flowers poppy rose rose peach and up here they should have grown by now is radishes second lot that's first lot early harvest that is kale space there to put something down we're applying carrots in pots and down here is going to be another carrot in pot we've got a sweet pea already growing three buckets ready for tomatoes which will be growing straight up inside this i'd call it a greenhouse another sweet pea there some charred strawberries in the corner some basil from seed and up here we've got a few more bad tomatoes some flowers and these plastic containers we're using are actually grape containers so like fruit or grape you get plums in them or grapes in them if i take you outside that's potatoes early potatoes just with a bit of covering on that is a camellia that's a lavender we've had to get rid of the old one because it got too uh, woody and this is a cut off of the old one and that's some type of flower that's rose azalea is not looking great rose that is japonic or something red red leaves uh, rose a lot better on well, when you have a dog you have to cover your beds it's a good trick to cover your beds so he doesn't dig them as you can see back there come here come he likes to dig Yes, you like to dig, don't you? Okay, going around, hammocks up, decent weather. Hebe and some foxgloves down there. Another rose, and that's the bottle brush plant. That bed is empty at the moment. We're planning to put tomatoes. Right here, we've got our canopy. Hoping to climb up the beans on this. You can see we've already put some beans down. That is pods pods not pods broad beans they should grow straight up the wire we've still got that purple plant from a few years ago it's getting ready we've moved the yasmin to the corner apple tree max has bitten off all the branches of the apple tree because he likes apples so that's here recovering that is the peach tree there and then down there is some tulips and hydrangea and here's our plum tree hasn't quite hit the spot yet with the leaves and that's everything 